Hello Cancers, how are you? I hope this finds you well. So we are going to be doing your weekly love reading and everything that you'll need to know, whether it's about this reading or scheduling your personal reading. So all of that is in the description box below for you. And I am doing same day readings today only. You guys can receive a three question recorded video reading for $25 and your reading will be sent to you within 24 hours from purchase. And information for how to schedule is in the description box below as well as on the community page. Alright my loves, we're going to go ahead and see what is going on for you this week. Overall energy of your love situation this week, we have the Sun card, very nice. So could be something that's just very positive, a positive shift here for you guys. Uh, something could be made, being made clear to you. So if there's been a, lot, a lack of clarity in your love situation, that could be turning around. That's kind of what this is feeling like to me. I'd ultimately just feel like it's very, very positive. Your energy. We have the two of wands and the three of wands. So there could have been a lot of conflict between you and somebody else. Yeah, we've got the lovers here. Cover and love. We got the lovers here at the bottom of the deck. So definitely a major turnaround, a shift here. Could be a major decision that is being made when it comes to this connection this week. I feel like this is a very strong, intense soul connection with that lover's energy being present. We have this two of wands and the three. So we have a lot of Aries energy here. You also have Leo and Gemini so far. But I feel like somebody has been... Waiting. I feel like you've been the one kind of waiting. You could be waiting on a decision from somebody else. I also feel like you could just be looking ahead towards the future and trying to see where something is going. Um, you know, the Three of Wands is a card of foresight. I feel like you've just been kind of looking ahead. And maybe that's where there has been a lack of clarity. Maybe you weren't sure where something was going with the person or if something was going to come back around or what decision a person was going to make when it came to you. What is the challenge here? For cancer this week. What is the challenge here for cancer this week? They have the two of swords. So two twos here plus that lover. So I definitely feel like there's a decision. Whether you have a major decision to make or somebody else. For a lot of you guys, I feel like somebody else is making a major decision when it comes to you. Okay, when it comes to this connection. It could be making a decision to move forward. I feel like something has been stagnant for a while between you and this person. Or things have been kind of at a standstill here. Uh, the Two of Swords is Moon and Libra energy. So we do have Libra energy showing up. But she's sitting on this concrete bench and it's meant to look like she's uncomfortable. It's meant to look like she's been sitting there for kind of a while. So I do, I feel like things could be feeling a little bit tense or have felt very tense and unclear. I really like that we have like this moon energy here with the sun energy over top of it because it's like where things have been cloudy, you're, you're gaining that clarity. Show me this person's energy towards Cancer this week. What is their energy towards Cancer, please? So we have the Justice card and the Judgment card. So somebody is making a major decision. We have Scorpio and Aries and Libra energy here again. So a major decision being made here. Some of you guys, this could have started, this situation could have started in Libra season and is now going to have this decision wrapped up here in Scorpio season. For others of you, you know, that doesn't have to resonate. For some of you guys, I feel like you've been in the stagnant energy from this person for quite some time. So they're making a major decision here. Tell me more about this. Tell me more about this justice card. Somebody could be wanting to make things right with you. At the Four of Pentacles and the Strength card. So if this is somebody that you guys are in separation with, no communication with somebody from your past, I feel like they have not let go of this at all. They have not let go of you, let, let go of the connection. I feel like they are finding the courage and the strength to move towards you here to come and tell you how they feel. Um, if this is somebody that you're waiting on some kind of choice, um, they could have been holding on to something else, somebody else maybe from their past or something else. Uh, for If that's the case, I feel like they're finding the courage to release that here. Now, for others of you, it could just be holding on to a way of life or a mindset. You know, Maybe this is somebody who's had a hard time settling down or committing. I feel like they've been trying to hold back too. 
Uh, for whatever reason, I feel like while they were making this decision, they were trying to hold back their energy. They may have been wanting to communicate with you for quite some time. You know, or there was a lot more that they wanted to say to you here, Cancer. But I feel like they felt like they had to hold back for whatever reason until they made this decision. What is this person's next? What is this person's true intentions? Let's go there. What are their true intentions? We have the Nine of Swords and the Seven of Wands. I feel like this person just really wants to be sure. The Seven of Wands can be a card of conviction. It's like knowing that you know deep down in your soul that something is for you or this is the right choice. Um, and with that Nine of Swords, I feel like somebody's been, you know, having sleepless nights. They've been in their head. They've been upset. They've been really, really reflecting on things. They're wanting to be very sure. He's sitting up in bed with his head in his hands. It's like he's woken up to something. I feel like this person has been having some major realizations here as well. And maybe that's what their intention is here is to, you know, to be sure and to have this clarity. And with that sun card being the overall energy, I feel like they're getting it. What are their next actions towards cancer? We have the three of swords and the wheel of fortune. You know, the wheel of fortune can definitely be a comeback around. It can be a shift. Um, it's fate. It's destiny uh, as well. And with this three of swords, I feel like they could want forgiveness as well and um, for some of you guys this could be forgiveness from things in the past for those of you where there was a third party situation involved i do feel like this could be them you know making that decision here with that judgment card to end this even though it may cause some pain um, in order to be able to move back towards you what's the potential outcome we have the lovers and the Nine of Cups. So if this is what you've been wishing for, if you've been wishing for this person to move back towards you here, look at the bottom of the deck, you guys have the Ace of Wands. If you guys have been wishing for somebody to move back towards you and you're wishing for a certain decision from this person or a specific outcome, it looks like that you're getting it here, Cancer. This is really beautiful. I feel like you're going to be really happy with the way that this turns out. I feel like somebody's making a major decision towards you. I feel like they've had a lot that they've wanted to say to you for quite some time. Um, and I feel like they're finally coming forward to express that. So I hope that this helps. If you have any comments or questions, please don't hesitate to express that. You can respond in the comments down below. If this doesn't resonate, that's okay. Check out your other placements. And if you want personal prayers for any reason, you can just put the little prayer emojis in the comments down below, and I will go through and pray for you. But if this is where we part, thank you for being here, and I will see you soon.